Hi, I'm Master Sergeant Glenn Chia from the Soldier Fitness Centre. Despite this challenging period caused by the COVID-19 outbreak, it is important that we continue to maintain our physical fitness, even if we're confined to our home. Exercising keeps our immune system strong, makes us less likely to fall sick, and energizes us. Today, I'll be sharing with you tips on how to do proper circuit training. Circuit training is an effective full body workout that can be done with or without equipment. Before you begin, it is important that you understand your fitness level and any medical conditions you may have, so you can better select the types of exercises and regulate the intensity of your training. Next, follow these three key principles. Exercise in a safe environment like at home. Select exercises that are challenging and able to sustain your interest. Lastly, these exercises should be enjoyable for you to continue doing them. Now, let me briefly explain to you how to select the exercises for your circuit training. There are four groups of exercises. Upper body, lower body, core and whole body. Each exercise also has a less strenuous version you can choose to do. Start by selecting five different exercises. One from each group and a fifth from any group of your choice. Keep track of what you've selected on a piece of paper or your phone. After selecting your five exercises, you can now start your circuit training. A typical circuit training can be between 5 to 30 minutes. I will now share with you how a 30 minute circuit can be designed. Begin with a 3 minute warm up, followed by 4 rounds of the 5 exercises you have chosen. Each round should last 5 minutes with a 1 minute break in between rounds. Finally, end the training with a 3 minute cooldown. You can use an interval timer app on your phone to keep track of your training duration. For maximum effectiveness, it's best to do circuit training 3 times a week. If you are new to this, start with a shorter, less intense circuit. If you are fitter and want to challenge yourself, you can either increase the number of reps per exercise or increase the number of rounds. If you remember, there are more than 20 exercises across the 4 groups. For the purpose of this video, we will only demonstrate 2 exercises from each group. You can view all the other exercises on our Singapore Army YouTube channel. Circuit training is just one of the many ways you can keep fit. Virtual classes and tips on how to stay active at home are available online and I'm sure you'll find something you can do and enjoy at the same time. It is important that we remain physically active. Even if we're unable to exercise regularly, just remember that any activity is better than none. Even taking short breaks, standing up or walking around the house counts. Thank you for watching, stay safe, stay healthy.